guys what is up it's Jack here and we are back baby it's actually been uh, about a month probably since I have recorded Minecraft I, uh, I stacked up on some videos Hope you, uh, hopefully you guys have been liking them which would be uh, be great my mic is down checking I always forget but what is this weird thing we're staring at here people I'm sure many of you know it's a, it's a simple, um, a very simple, what's it called, daylight sensor to daytime thing, I guess. Yeah, sure, why not? Um, basically what it is is a daylight sensor, which detects the daylight, no shit, uh, that outputs a signal during the day, and then we have a, it's not really called a flip flop, but it, it flips the signal, so the redstone torches fall off and then we go into the command block and set the time today so whenever the signal is off it will be normal you know settings for a time of day and then when the current stops transmitting this light or this redstone lamp will go on making the command block activate and it's a never ending cycle so yeah that's that's what's new um, but what are we doing today guys we are making ready for this one a house shocker I know <laughs> um, so we're making it right here I'm trying to stay within the same area and it's you know the same modern-ish style well actually this one's pretty modern uh, house just gonna clear some land here. Um, so yeah, we are back and better than ever. We are gonna be building, like I said, another another modern house. And what is that floating right there? Huh? What is that? Oh Lord. Okay. Oh, you know what? It's probably, yeah, it's part of the flower. Uh, we are going to be changing this texture pack. Uh, or not. Uh, there are so many things I love with this texture pack. Love about this texture pack, like the fridge and all that kind of stuff. But when it comes to, like, flowers and, you know, other kind of stuff like that, it's just so bad for it. It's really bad. So... We will see. I'm probably I'll probably end up making my own touch back to be to be honest. Uh, just because it's gonna be a lot better. It'll be suited to my needs, so it's gonna be probably a mixture pack of this, which is Jammercraft. And uh, what's the other one I've been using? It is uh, 1.6 flows HD. Which I'll give you though. Actually no, let's do that right now. Give you a look at what we'll kind of be switching to. The blow, there we go. Kind of almost sfaxy. If you know what that is, I'm sure you do. Maybe you know what I mean. It's kind of like that. Uh, although I haven't really used sfax in over a year, so I could be completely wrong. <laughs> we all know me though. Probably not. So, Alright guys, I'm just going to go ahead and clear out this area. And uh, I'll bring you guys right on back when we're done. I'm gonna fill it up too. So, all right, be right back. Okay, guys. So I actually go a little bit of ahead, a little bit of ahead, a little bit ahead, and uh, made our, our starting platform, I guess. Um, and it is eight wide by long. One, two, three, four, six, seven. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 8 by 26. I did end up carving out a little more of that. And, you know, just to fit the dimensions so a bit more nicely. Um, so, what do we need? Um, did I ever do this? I got rid of them? I don't know. Whatever. Uh oh, we need wool, glowstone. Uh, we're going to need some iron doors, some pressure plates, 
uh, some glass panes, and I think that about does it up. Oh, and we're gonna need um, some ladders. Mm, no, let's do, let's get some slabs. Let's get some stone slabs. That should that should be good. Uh, so what we're gonna do here is make our base house gonna be a six by eight. Sure, why not? Can leave the center two cut out. We can do that, and we can cut out those two as well. We're gonna go ahead and put some windows in there. know the drill by now. Four tall with three for the windows. Yeah, you guys know what you're doing by now. If you know, if you've been watching them the whole time, if you're a, if you're a loyal fan, then you guys know exactly what you're doing. You're used to it by now, I think. Right? Are we, how many houses have we done in this style? I guess really only one. There, uh, there were some beforehand, I guess. I don't know, man. Whatever. If you're not, then I don't blame you. Because clearly I'm not even aware of what I'm doing. So, whatever. No big deal. Uh, let's go ahead. Sorry, my AC just turned on, of course. Wrong with the perfect timing. Uh, I, should, I, I mean it. Hot, it's hot up here. Um, Alright, there we go. Now, what we're doing... The rest of it is so we're gonna. This is all gonna be outdoor space. We'll of course, decorate it next episode. What we're gonna now do is build our frame. One more. Two, four, six, eight. There we go. And all the way back. And this next floor, the second floor, and only real floor, I guess, is gonna be our living space. Uh, this room. Well, first of all, let's go ahead and just set our doors on so we can actually get in. Uh, what it's going to be is a stair-ish well. Uh, let's just do a simple, right? Perfect. It actually it works. It ends on the same block, you know? You know? You know. All right. Go ahead and fill this all in, and I will be right back. So we have that done, and I'm gonna decide to de decide to place decide to replace this last block here with that. It does the same thing, and truth be told, I think it looks a lot better from underneath. So I'm thinking we need maybe some kind of support. I mean, obviously we don't need it, but like. I think it needs something there. I don't think it's gonna look good just straight, is it? Maybe just on the back. Yeah, man. I dig it. I think it works. So, last but not least, let's get up into the second floor and finish off the design and next episode we will get into the decorating um, and I think we might have to do a twist a, a, a flip it a, a flip the effect I guess uh, we're putting the lights on the top I think it might look a little weird having the lights on the bottom like that um, you know what no no it won't because it's gonna give us lighting down there which which we need so basically what it is is that around the corners, except on this corner, it's only one. See what I'm doing? I did there. I'll have to look at it. Not really a way to explain it. No. And 
then on this corner, it is the same on that, and it is in fact the same on this one. Sorry, I'm lagging really, my frame rate is dropping really bad. So that's the one different, the rest are like L's, that's just more of a stare, I, guess. I don't know, let me look at it from the top. Uh, the rest of our spaces are all going to be glowstone. I like, I actually like it, it's going to give us nice uh, even toned lighting below as well as above, which is cool. I think that might look nice over there, how it's not all, yeah man. It's looking sweet. Sweet. Uh, this one, maybe not. We'll see about that one. But uh, the rest of them, just every space in between these pillar type things is all glowstone, and thus windows on top of them. Once again, you guys know the drill for that, so just go ahead and do that. And you know what I mean. I'm gonna go ahead and do that, and then I'll be back on. Uh, I'll probably do the roof too, and then I'll be back on to wrap up the video. All right, guys. So the last thing we're gonna add here is our railing, just the full five wide, I guess, four and a half. I don't know. Whatever you wanna call it. And what is up with my frame rate? Thirty frames. It's decent. Whatever. And I gotta say, guys, it looks pretty good. It's looking pretty banging. Uh, let's, I just want to see what looks out looks without this. All right. Uh, I don't know, guys. It looks pretty badass both ways. Oops, too much time. All right. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go with this way. We'll see though. We will see as time goes on. So, all right, guys, that about does it up for me this episode. Thank you all for watching very much, and it helps. Oh, sorry, that was pretty loud. Knuckle crack there. Oh, another one. All right, I will stop cracking my knuckles. Um. Anyways, whatever I was saying. Thank you all for watching. A rating is always very helpful, and uh, along with the sub, if you're not already, to be notified. And, that kind of stuff when a new video goes out, which is looking to be every one, two, maybe three days at the longest, unless I forget, which is like four days at the most, which hopefully will never happen. It's only happened once, I think. So, alright, guys. Thank you for watching.